Hello everybody, I'd like to introduce myself and my background before sharing my plans for the Daphne Champions role. My name is Adrian Hickford, I've been working in transport research at Southampton University for, for over 25 years, initially working on projects focusing on improving road safety modelling and accident data collection. But over the years I've worked on a number of other topics, including freight studies and monitoring and evaluation of interventions to promote road safety and active and sustainable travel. I was part of the original team when ITRC, that's the Infrastructure Transitions Research Consortium, started back in 2011. And I've been involved in many of the major outputs, including co-authoring the book that was written at the end of the first, first five-year programme. I helped the sector teams who were working with NISMOD, that's ITRC's National Infrastructure Systems Model, to develop the strategies for future infrastructure provision that were central to that earlier assessment. And recently, in the second phase of ITRC, Mistral, I've been the lead author on a report into the Oxford Cambridge Arc case study and also looking at pathways to decarbonise transport in the next 30 years in England's economic heartland, using outputs from the transport model, with lots of help setting up the model runs from one of my ITRC colleagues in Oxford and a fellow Daphne champion, Tom Russell. I should make it clear, I am not a modeller, but there was some coding back in the day as part of the early roads safety analysis, that was a long time ago, but I do have plenty of experience with learning and using new software, as I'm sure we all do. So the original specification for the Daphne champion role had three core activities based on identifying use cases within the university, advocacy for the platform, and giving relevant feedback to the Daphne team. There were also a number of additional tasks. Uh, so, so this is an overview then of my plan for these activities. I'll firstly identify potential users within the engineering department and further afield within the university, including a focus on users of the UCRIC funded National Infrastructure Lab and their Daphne funded computing facilities, as well as getting involved once the proposed virtual room has been built. Secondly, I'll arrange discussions and meetings and presentations with, with teams or individuals to give them a broad picture of how they might find the Daphne facilities useful for their research. A second part of this advocacy role is looking beyond the university. So I'll be looking to set up a survey of members of the wider transport research community in the UK via the UTSG mailing list. That's the university's transport study group. To try to find out what are the key requirements for a facility such as Daphne and, and how might it be appropriate for transport research generally. Uh, we had hoped to be presenting at the UTSG annual conference this year, but that's obviously been cancelled, but we may be able to host a webinar instead uh, for those transport researchers who are interested in learning more. The third strand is user feedback, and I come to this effectively as a new user, so I'll mainly be focusing on the visualisation suite and outputs from the modelling service and the underlying database. Now, I'm not sure how useful this feedback is going to be, but I think it'll at least be a, from a relatively unusual perspective among the other champions. I'm also about to start an impact acceleration account funded study aiming to build and strengthen relationships with transport bodies both regionally and nationally, seeing how the NISMOD transport model can be applied in different arenas and I can use those interactions to promote Daphne facilities and identify other potential future use cases. So here's then the eight month timeline for the various activities and a list of the expected deliverables. So as well as identifying potential users and future collaborators, we hope to produce a paper based on the UTSG survey results and a working paper relating to user feedback. I also plan to set up a SharePoint site at the university and to act as a repository, uh, a central resource for researchers to, to get more information, the repository for presentations and other outputs that may be of interest. So that's a hopefully a very brief but useful overview of, of my, my potential, my future role as the Daphne champion. I look forward to working with everyone.